Hey YouTube, it's Michael Lambert here. I'm back once again with another reaction video. Once again, I'm reacting to the endorsement in this video. Pringles Hot Honey Review Walmart Exclusive. The endorsement. This is one of the new ones that he uploaded yesterday and I'm going to react to it right now. And if any notifications pop up during the video, I apologize and I will take care of them. Now let's get to this video. Alright, listen, we took it into the living room today, a uh, little intimate uh, review, and only at Walmart Flavor, Walmart exclusive, we have the Pringles Hot Honey, we're going to check it out, cue the intro. <laughs> What's up, everyone? It is the endorsement, and it is time for another review. This is where I try something and tell you if you should like it or not. I can be very persuasive. All right, so many random things on the coffee table. We have the uh, Xbox uh, remote. We have a uh, remote control. There is a tennis racket, and I'm holding up the uh, tripod with a blanket, a box of corn checks, and a box of Kellogg's Frosted Rice Krispies. It's, it just doesn't get any more professional. So, here we go. Pringles Hot Honey, uh, only at Walmart. Uh, I think they just started adding this on the can. Nothing half full about this can. So that's a little shot at the uh, potato chips out there that come in the bags. And everyone says, no, they have to keep all that extra air in there uh, so that the chips do not break, something like that. Uh, so I guess there's a method to the madness on why you have that extra air. Uh, but check it out. Cornelius Pringle. Is that his name? I always forget his name. Uh, but like I mentioned in the intro, this is only at Walmart. You see it up on the top right there. They even have the Walmart blue. Uh, pretty fancy stuff. There's another flavor as well. Uh, I just saw Big John uh, TV uh, reviewed this. I shut it off before they reviewed this. Uh, I didn't want to be swayed. Uh, but they also found the uh, Philly cheesesteak. I think it was Philly cheesesteak. Uh, comes in a purple can. My Walmart only had this flavor. Uh, but I almost gave up on it. I was looking around at all of the flavors of Pringles. Hold on, everyone. Notification. Sorry about that, everybody. Pringle. Uh, Pringle. Why, why did I think? Why did I make that singular? Pringles. And I almost gave up, and I looked up to the very top, and right on the top was a box of the hot honey. All right, so let's open it up and give these bad boys a smell and see what we're dealing with with the hot honey Pringles. Okay. Smells like, um, potato. Potato. All right, there's one of them right there. Check it out. All right, let's go. I like this uh, setup. I'm just staring at a blanket, some cereal, a tennis racket. Sorry, I had an itch right there. Sorry about that, everybody. And I yawned a little bit, too. Sorry about that, everybody. What's on the ground over there? An empty bottle of water? Uh, yeah, this <laughs> This is what's going on. Uh, let's go. Hot honey, uh, only at Walmart Pringles. Uh, let's go. Here we go. Got the honey right up front. Let's see if we get any of the um, hot. I'm going to eat the next one down like this because everyone says if you eat it like this, you're eating it incorrectly. That's the only way I eat it because it's shaped to go right on the tongue. They said you got to eat it sideways or upside down ways uh, to get all of the uh, flavor. When you look at a Pringle, the amount of flavoring on uh, one side compared to another side seems about the same to me. Well, let's go this way and then kind of bite down and uh, rip into your uh, gum line and your lips because uh, it should go like this. It fits in perfectly uh, is what it is. Doesn't feel natural. Didn't give me any more flavor. Hmm. I'm getting sweetness. I'm waiting for the hot. I'm waiting for any type of heat. I 
guess it's right there on the back end. Uh, but I'm going to tell you, if I had to rate the heat on this hot honey, probably a one and a half out of ten. A one and a half out of ten. It's almost non-existent. Uh, the sweetness is there, and that's uh, almost non-existent as well. It's just sweetness, and then you're getting the uh, salt. Uh, but I'm really not getting the hot, and even shows right there. Got the uh, pepper right there, mixing in uh, with the honey. I have some Mike's uh, hot honey, actual hot honey in the uh, cupboard. Maybe I'll bust that out and do a little dip, dip uh, at the end of this video. Uh, a couple more. more sweet than anything not hot at all hmm. little disappointed little disappointed let's get out the honey All right, so listen, a um, little bit of salt, a little bit of sweet, and a tad of hot. Uh, that's what I'm getting from these uh, limited edition Walmart uh, Pringles. Uh, but here we go. The Mike's Hot Honey, I've said in a couple videos, this right here, this condiment should be in every kitchen in America. So let's, uh, as you can see, I've gone through this one pretty good, but don't fret. Don't worry about me. I got it covered because there's another bottle in the cupboard. Do you say cupboard or do you say cabinet? Do you say cupboard or cabinet? All right, let's get one of these out and um, let's get some of this hot honey on here. Let's go. Let's pick it up a notch here. Pringle. Pringles. I keep wanting to say Pringle. Sorry, everyone. I had to crack my neck a little bit. Sorry about that. All right, check it out. That's hot honey on hot honey. Here we go. So good. To the heat on there, it's instant and the sweetness. Heat on the um, Mike's hot honey. It's probably like a four. Perfect amount with the sweetness. I'm getting one more. I mean, this, I was just doing it because it's hot honey. This is not something I would do if I eat uh, the rest of these. I just wanted to kind of compare the taste of Mike's hot honey on the hot honey. Whew, it's even kind of uh, tickling the uh, back of the esophagus. All right, final bite. Yeah. All right, so listen, this stuff, I put it on everything. Chicken, fish, uh, ice cream, eggs. You name it, I put it on here. I drizzle it on the top of my salad each night. Um, it's so good. Uh, but all right, so rating, uh, 1 to 100, if I had to give this a rating, um, I'm a little disappointed because I love hot honey. I just uh, praised that, that bottle right there. I'm going to give this 1 to 100. Um, it's like a 71. Barely reaching the uh, 70 barrier. I was almost thinking like 67, 68, uh, but I will finish them. Uh, I do enjoy the sweetness of them, but it could be a lot better, a lot, lot better. Um, so yeah, there you go. Another review in the books. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Also, please do not forget to check me out on Instagram and Twitter. That is social media, getting the word on my channel out to the masses. In closing, uh, let me know if you have found these. Let me know if you're going to try these. And let me know if you're going to actually go try and find them. Uh, like I said, they just recently came out maybe a couple days ago, maybe last week. Uh, and there's also the Philly uh, cheesesteak version. I feel that flavor has been done so many times with pizza and chips and other things. Um, I digress. All right. So uh, there you go. Oh, I was just adjusting. Did you see? Did you see? New hat. New Hampshire Fisher Cats. Shout out New Hampshire. It's one of my favorite fits. It fits good. Some of the ones you get because they're made all individually. Uh, sometimes they don't fit perfect. Some fits uh, a little snug. Some fits a little too big. And some fits perfect. Uh, and this is one of the perfect fits. So, um, all right. Thank you so much. And we'll see you soon with some more reviews. Bye. <sighs>
awesome video. I give it a thumbs up, and I hope you all enjoyed this reaction video. If you're all new to my main channel or my second channel or the endorsements channel, make sure you guys subscribe. Give both our videos a thumbs up. Hit the notification bell to let you guys know when we both post and share both of our videos with your friends and family members too, please, everybody. And on my main channel, we are on the road to 6,000 subscribers. And on my second channel, we are on the road to 2,000 subscribers. And please don't forget to take a look at my other videos on my channel's playlists on both my main channel and my second channel. Give them a thumbs up and share them with your friends and family members too, please, everybody. I would really appreciate it. And please help me accomplish my goal to get 6,000 subscribers or more on my main channel and 2,000 subscribers or more on my second channel too, please, everybody. I would really appreciate that too. And I'm off now, so until next time, see ya.